Hello everyone, I'm Pharmacist Michael, and today I'm going to talk about an alternative to statins to help with your cholesterol levels. Bepidoic acid is a novel medication that has gained attention for its potential to address elevated levels of low-density lipoprotein cholesterol, or LDLC, which is commonly referred to as bad cholesterol. It belongs to a class of drugs known as ATP citrate lyase inhibitors and offers a new approach to cholesterol management. Bepidoic acid, when used in conjunction with other lipid-lowering therapies, showcases promise in reducing cardiovascular risk and improving lipid profiles. It is available alone as Nexlitol and in combination with azetamibe as Nexlizet. The primary purpose of bepidoic acid is to lower LDLC levels, which are a significant risk factor for the development of atherosclerosis and cardiovascular diseases. Unlike traditional statins, which primarily work by inhibiting cholesterol synthesis in the liver, bepidoic acid targets a different step in the cholesterol synthesis pathway. It inhibits the enzyme ATP citrate lyase, which is responsible for producing the precursor molecule acetyl-CoA. By disrupting this pathway, bempidoic acid helps decrease cholesterol production in the liver, leading to lowered LDLC levels in the bloodstream. Bempidoic acid is often prescribed to individuals who require additional cholesterol-lowering options alongside statins, or for those who cannot tolerate statin therapy due to adverse effects. Its combination with statins has shown further LDLC reduction, indicating its potential to enhance the efficacy of existing lipid-lowering treatments. However, like any medication, bempidoic acid is not without its limitations and considerations. Some individuals may experience side effects, including muscle-related issues and gastrointestinal symptoms. It can also increase uric acid levels, which may lead to gout attacks. Approximately 10% of patients with gout who take bempidoic acid report a gout flare-up. Gallstones develop in about one out of every 100 patients who take bempidoic acid, and this drug should be used in caution in those with gallbladder disease. It's crucial for healthcare professionals to evaluate patients' medical histories, other medications, and potential interactions before prescribing bempidoic acid. Furthermore, the long-term cardiovascular benefits and safety profile of bempidoic acid are still subjects of ongoing research and evaluation. Clinical trials are continuously assessing its impact on reducing cardiovascular events and mortality. As of now, bempidoic acid represents a promising addition to the arsenal of cholesterol-lowering therapies, but its full scope of benefits and risks will become clearer as more data emerges. Bempidoic acid is not cheap. It can cost over $400 a month for therapy. Bempidoic acid presents a novel approach to managing elevated LDLC levels and reducing cardiovascular risk. Its ability to inhibit cholesterol synthesis through a different pathway offers an alternative for individuals who may not respond well or tolerate traditional statin therapy. However, while bempidoic acid shows potential, it's important for both healthcare providers and patients to stay informed about its evolving research landscape and consult medical professionals before making treatment decisions. As with any medical intervention, personalized care and informed decision making are key to optimizing health outcomes. If you know anyone who would benefit from this video, please send it to them. If you've enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up and please subscribe to our channel for more happy, healthy living information. I have placed several links 
to products that can make you a happier, healthier person in the description section of this video. So don't forget to take a look at those. My name is Pharmacist Michael. Be happy and be healthy.